China's Defense Minister Dong Jun is visiting Singapore for the first time since he was appointed to the role last December. He will attend the Shangri-La Dialogue, a high-level security forum attended by defense chiefs from around the world. There he will speak on his country's approach to global security on Sunday. Admiral Dong received a ceremonial welcome at Singapore's Defence Ministry accompanied by Defence Minister Ng Eng Hen. Both men later co-chaired the Singapore-China Defence Minister's Dialogue, where they reaffirmed the positive momentum in defence relations. They also expressed support for upcoming defence exercises this year. They said, these enable the two sides to strengthen professional and people-to-people -people ties, as well as enhance mutual trust and understanding. Admiral Dong also visited Changi Naval Base, where he toured a Singapore warship and the Navy Museum. As part of his introductory visit, Admiral Dong is expected to call on Singapore's new Prime Minister, Lawrence Wong, as well as Senior Minister and Coordinating Minister for National Security, Tio Chi Hien. While the Chinese Defence Chief will have the opportunity to meet his US counterpart at the Shangri-La Dialogue this weekend. Now, this meeting will mark their first face-to-face -face talks in 18 months. CNA's China correspondent Olivia Song tells us how much it will actually move the needle in managing China-US ties. I've been talking to observers to get a sense of how they think these, this big meeting will go. There's a lot at stake, obviously, but I think the consensus seems to be that the fact that the defence chiefs of China and the US, the fact that they are meeting is a win in itself, that it will help progress and help both sides to manage their differences uh, on the security front. But we do have to note that we are still waiting for final confirmation that this meeting is going to happen, but the groundwork has certainly been laid for it. We know that uh, the two defence chiefs already spoke over the phone in April. That was the first time that they were speaking to each other after uh, Dong Jun was appointed to the post uh, back in December last year, after the previous Chinese defence minister was abruptly removed from his post. But observers are also saying that probably we won't expect anything very substantive from these talks. Uh, we will likely hear China and the US continue to reiterate the positions on uh, rather thorny issues that they will have have to talk about whether it's over Taiwan, given those recent drills that Beijing had uh, around the island, or whether it comes to the South China Sea, uh, Beijing angered by U.S. Uh, activities in the waters, which it sees as provocation. So. What we will be looking out for, though, is the tone, uh, whether it's just a symbolic reiteration of positions or will there be an escalation? 